the Lord, he says, they don't fear those who destroy the body, fear those who destroy the soul. Science doesn't say that Mary, she can have a child without a man. I believe, against science. Science doesn't say that there's someone he can fast for 40 days. Nobody can do that, I believe. But the most thing, most important, to make me follow Jesus, that everything he said is beyond wisdom. One sentence of Christ's teaching will destroy all the books of wisdom. Love your enemy. Love your enemy. Love your enemy. If everybody loves his enemy, this earth will turn into heaven. Because then nobody has an enemy. Human beings, they are desperately in need of money, and jobs, and food. Yet they spend trillions of dollars on arms and weapons to kill each other. They don't love their enemy. They want to kill each other. If somebody is wrong, correct him. But don't think you are better than him. For all the world commits sin. Otherwise, why the Messiah came? When you compromise with little thing, you're in compromising with your honor. And then your faith. And then you are gone. You are just a soul owned by the devil. Don't believe in someone he promised you virgins in heaven. God is not a pimp. Women are created just for my sexual desire in heaven. Of filthy. But this is what happened when you follow satanic God and satanic prophet. Follow Satan as you wish. And I follow God. He said, I am the way, I am the door, I am the life, I am the resurrection. We pray that the Lord forgive us for our sin, for all of us we are sinners. We pray that the Lord, He will open the eyes of the Muslims. The Lord, He says, I am the truth, and the truth will set you free. So, the only thing can set a person free is the Lord. When I bring a Muslim to Christ, I'm not the one setting him free. It is our Lord. I'm just here serving, doing my duty to provide them with information to understand that what they've been taught about the Messiah is a lie. But the one who will save them is not me. So we pray that the whole Muslims will listen. We pray that the Christians will be united. We pray that the Christians and you know all of us will support each other to love, not to hate. We don't want support of hate. We don't want hatred. Hatred is from the devil. So my friends, my family, Muslims, we don't hate you. We Christians, we've been ordered to love everybody. And Jesus, he said, I came for the sick. I did not come for the healthy. So if our Lord himself, he come for the sick, and if Islam is sick, so we are coming to save you from the sickness of Islam. And the one who wanna save you from the sickness of Islam, he don't hate you. 